Hey balls, it's Horton here, and it is like the first really warm day of 2017 here in Bakersfield. I really wish I was skiing. It's time to get going. Spring skiing means wetsuits. And uh, as I was thinking about getting ready this year, I contacted uh, June at Stokes to take a look at their new kind of really premium wetsuit. Now, Stokes is kind of known for their jump equipment. In fact, the company was founded by a pretty highly regarded jump coach, uh, Ray Stokes. And uh, they've got jump skis and slings and three event bags. But what you guys care about is vests and wetsuits. So, as always, I have a box. Uh, this one looks like it's been around the world. Got my knife from uh, Weapons Edge. Thank you, Jeff Gastra. And we're just going to open this sucker up. And see what the folks at Stokes sent me. You know, that's not it. All right. So, start out with what looks like a Stokes T-shirt. Thank you, June. I will wear this proudly. We have a Stokes towel. Same deal. Thank you very much. Rico, you may not, you may not wipe down the boat with this towel. This is my towel. Don't wipe down the boat. Oh, let's take it some gloves there. So we've got some gloves. We'll try these on last. Uh, we've got this suit from Stokes. I've never seen one before. Very nice. Smooth skin on the outside. Stitched. Fabric on the inside looks, uh, looks like it's going to be really stretchy. So um, I'm not going to take my pants off right now on camera and put this on. Uh, I'm sure you're all relieved. But I'll be skiing in this, and I'll report back on that. Um, so this is a beautiful suit. I think um, we're seeing in water skiing kind of a, a push towards kind of more premium suits. You know, in years past, we've gotten... Suits from surfers, we've got some poorly made suits. There's, there's nothing that makes me angrier than a suit that's too tight in the neck. And uh, we're seeing better and better stuff all the time. So, nice, nice seals on the zipper. So, like I said, I'm going to try this on, not on camera, and report back. So that's really nice. And then, this I've seen before. Not in these colors, maybe not exactly this model, but I know a number of people that have these Stokes vests, and they seem to last a really long time, and they seem to be really comfortable. Now you see kind of uh, thicker flotation panels, where it matters, and then it's like really, really thin where you need movement. So I expect this thing to be really flexible. Let's... Uh, Try this thing on. It's never a, it's never a good thing first time of the year, or I should say, vests never fit great the first time you put them on in the spring. I like it. Looking forward to skiing in it. So um, I will uh, try this stuff out in a couple of weeks when I start skiing. Oh, look at this! Look at this! This is really cool. See how thin that is right there? a lot of mobility there. So, so I'll try this out and I will uh, I will report back. Thank you, Ballers. Hey, Ballers. So I almost forgot about the gloves. Sorry about that. There's been a trend in the last, I don't know, five, ten years where a lot of skiers are going to a thinner, very tight glove that's not terribly padded and is not Kevlar. And that is this style of glove. So uh, I know some of you, some of the Ballers, some of the better skiers in the forum 
I'm already using these, um, and uh, I really haven't skied with them in the past. So I'm going to give these a try. I'm looking forward to it. Um, I think people feel like they just get like a, like a really fantastic grip out of them. Um, we'll see. So um, the vest, super impressed with. I'm going to try the wetsuit on next time I get in the water. Looking forward to that. Uh, not going to punish you with my, uh, my winter figure. Um, but um, if you're curious, go to stokeskis.com. Check it out. Some of their products are available at uh, Performance Ski and Surf. Of course, I always highly recommend Performance Ski and Surf. And um, as I use this stuff more, I'll um, add more feedback. Thank you, Ballers.